Hey man, what's going on y'all? Before I get into this video, man, um, I want to dedicate this video to uh, my late brother, man, my late homeboy that just passed away this morning. Um, I finally passed away this morning. He got shot at the club he worked at, man. R.P. Jawan. R.P. my boy Nino, man. Jawan, a.k.a. Nino, man. Damn, man, these streets don't love nobody, and I want everybody to know, man. I love them, you know what I mean? Cause you never know when somebody can take your life or you never know when God gonna be calling you home. You know what I mean? I just spoke to bro Wednesday. My boy supported everything I did, whether if it was a music video, a song dropping, uh, uh, a video dropping on YouTube. It don't matter what I did, bro, behind me all the way. And I really, grew, like, I really seen my bro grow up to be a real true player. Like, he grew up to be a very nice young man and he had a lot of motion going for himself. I had a, had some money in his pocket, you know, just, I guess, the city, you know what I mean? The city don't like when players be winning, so they really, like, yeah, I hate to say what they did what they did, but, like, damn, like, I wish I wasn't saying this right now, because, like, I hate it. They, they keep taking my partners, like, come on, man, like, sometimes gun violence ain't the answer all the time, bro, especially, you know, I found out it was over something real, real, real petty, so... I don't think that was the answer for it, but it is what it is. I know your spirit gonna always live on this world, man. So, just watch over me, brother, you know, because I'm a player just like you were. And, you know, niggas in the city ain't respecting the players and they hating on them. They trying to get them off. That's why I move how I move. That's why I be on planes each and every week, because I can't stay in Atlanta for too long. And it was in the hometown. Come on, man. That's why I, I don't. That's why I move how I move. But... Yeah, man, this video dedicated to my boy Nino, man. R.I.P. Long live my boy. That's that. Enjoy the video, man. Stay up. Go, prime time, go. Prime time, go. Prime time, go. I'm tripping so much flavor when I pull up to my show. I only rock my clear. Keep the logo on my coat. Youngest nigga has no when I'm the go. Yo, at this point, it just feels like I just live out of bag. I just live out of a bag, and I'm always on the go. No cap. Definitely gotta grab my charger. Can't forget to charge. Throw this phone in there. It's crazy, man. This is the airport, not the mall. It's like... It's like I live here now. It's like I live in the airport. Catch planes more than I catch Ubers. That would have seemed like. I'm really tired of it, honest. Right, I'm tired, I'm sleeping. Security hole just. Yeah, let me get some of that. Fish head, fish head. You know what I'm saying? Hand, good hand sanitizer. What I was finna say was. Security lady just touched my dick. Like, why you had to check my inner thigh? I mean, you could have checked my inner thigh, but he ain't had to touch the dick, though. Shotty ain't have to do it. Just let security. That's what she just did. I'm snitching. Let me find out these little security guys be freaky. Let me find out y'all be little freaky dicks. It would have uh, Shotty seen the, 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 the sweats. You know what I mean? She seen a young tenderoni. You know what I mean? She looked like she was about in her high thirties. She seen a, 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 a young a young nigga in, her, in, her, in his low twenties. And one that, you know, catch a feel. I don't blame you, baby. You know what I mean? I don't blame you at all. Niggas be waiting all day for this train. Only in Atlanta where you gotta wait all day for the train. No. <clears throat> I dropped my boarding pass. Damn it. Can I see where it says Houston? Houston hobby. C7, 530. All right. 
Gotta get a new boarding pass, y'all, cuz. I don't know, I guess I forgot to get it from security. I don't know. Lost my boarding pass, they got to print me a new one. Y'all like my little hair, dude? Yeah. Couldn't get my hair done before I went on this trip. It's all good though. At least I was able to get a little lined up. I feel like I look cool, cool enough. Glad I got to eat me some chicken wings before this little flight. Cause nigga was hungry. I don't even want to eat. Right, see, I, I be here so much. This is Seagate's Chick Fil A right here, Krispy Kreme right there. I know where everything is. So the Krispy Kreme Chick-fil-A gonna be right here on the left coming up with the little across the street from the little headphone so you know what I mean didn't know where everything at and I used to work on this floor a long time ago. Airport trip check. I see you looking at you know what I mean. Checking the drip out, it's all good. Yeah. Big crown, big head. I know what's going on, man. Yeah, Shotty just seen a sweat. You know what I mean? She want a little feel. Oh, I need it. Oh, yeah. For shit show. Subscribe to OnlyFans, too. Content on the way. Yeah. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. I'm about to get on this plane. See what's going on, man. I'm gonna go right to sleep. Small portable electronic devices like tablets, e-readers, electronic games, MP3 players may be used during all phases of life, but must be in airplane or game mode only. Once that door is closed, all cell phones will have to be in airplane. Rear seat in that emergency exit. They're doing all this talking this time. Don't feel like functioning. You need to let us know after we meet you. So we can push back from the gate. Please make sure your seatbelt. Okay, what's up, y'all, man? Um, let me just put y'all down on what's really going on. Um, so, yeah, I just got back to Houston and whatnot. Y'all know how I just be traveling back from Houston to Atlanta and just all these different places, man. Um, I currently live in Atlanta right now, um, but I think I'm about to have two spots. I think it's time to just go ahead and just buckle down with two spots in two of the cities I'm basically in the most and that's Atlanta and Houston so I think I'm about ready to just go ahead and start looking for places in Houston to live also I think I want like a cool little apartment out here so I could just have somewhere to stay when I touch down here because I done spent about almost five thousand dollars on hotels in the past month and that's no cap like I'll be coming to Houston so much and then I'll be buying all these flights and it's down the third it's just like every this it's, it's getting tiring at this point and I'm just, you know, just basically ready to settle down and just be comfortable, man. Like, um, every time I come to Houston, I spend so much damn money on just, like, 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 like I said, hotels, Ubers, and just everything in that type of nature. And I'm just, you know, I'm just ready to just settle down. I know y'all like when I'm in Houston, my algorithm does very well when I'm in Houston because y'all know I'm linking up and collabing with different YouTubers and different people y'all like to see me with and stuff like that. So, I really think it's about that time. I hope you guys are excited for a nigga because I'm really about to start looking for places to stay and places to live and stuff like that. Um, probably going to bring my car here as well too because when it comes to YouTube, I'm working more out here. But when it comes to music, I'm working more in Atlanta. So, you know, in Atlanta, I'm always good. I'm always straight, like, point blank period. That's forever going to be the city. But Houston, it's time to get more comfortable out here in this area. I really like Houston, you know what I mean? Um, I like the vibe here. It's not too crazy. It keep me away from the streets in Atlanta, you know what I mean? It's just, I'm, I, I'm, I feel out the way here. Nobody else going to know where I stay. Nobody just going to know information about my whereabouts. And that's how I like it because in Atlanta, it's, it's a quite bit different. I get very distracted in Atlanta because I do multiple things, not just the YouTube thing. Like in Atlanta, I got so much other stuff going on. Right now, I'm just trying to stay focused on my grind and stay focused for y'all. So y'all can keep watching me and keep watching me go up. So this move is pretty big to me because it's like I'm coming back to Houston. Y'all know if, if y'all are true supporters of me, 
y'all know I already did this before for like three months, like last year when I first started YouTube, and I ended up moving back to Atlanta. Well, now it's time again to get another change, and you know, just instead of doing like the YouTube house thing, just get my own little place and just be comfortable, man. I'm very blessed to be able to have two spots. I'm I'm very blessed to be in the position I am today. I hope y'all proud of me and stuff like that. It's gonna be a movie when I come out here, man. I look forward to collabing with all these different Houston folks that have been hitting my DM and stuff like that. I'm ready to work, you know what I mean? Yeah, man, this, this is me putting y'all down on what's going on. Y'all know I'm gonna put y'all down with every little thing. You know what I mean? Just came back from Atlanta today. If y'all want me to do house tours and apartment tours, it's probably gonna be apartment. I ain't really too big on getting a house right now. I don't see what I need a house for. I ain't got a wife, I ain't got a kids, no none of that. So I'm gonna just probably stick with apartment for right now. If y'all want me to do the little tours and stuff like that, let me know. Um, I don't think I'm going to do like, like, I'm definitely not going to show the location because I don't want people to know where I'll be staying and my whereabouts and stuff like that, you know what I mean? Because it's bigger than YouTube, you know what I mean? I got a whole bunch of other stuff going on outside in the street, street world, real world, whatever, however you want to put it. You know what I mean? I got too much going on in that, in that world, so I ain't going to let all the info out, but y'all going to see a little bit of stuff here and there, so... Make sure y'all keep running numbers up. Thank you for 65K. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on the gram if you already haven't. She getting bigger and bigger every day, man. I love the Prime family. I love y'all. Let's just keep going up. I'm out this thing. It's your boy Prime Time. Hitler.